Okay, it's Damien. I'm going to show you how to make a template using images from Unsplash. So this way you will reduce file size because they're links, absolute links to another site while it's live. So you can use the images be randomly for your template or theme and um, excellent excellent photos I mean you look at unsplash here and it's quality stuff it's all free you can download download anything download anything let me see here download button it's all free but on this I'm showing you how to do it using links that way it reduces the file size let's have a look okay I'm on my site and these are the free wire frames I made all free there's 10 there and this was I called aperitif and if I view that I'll get to the download I'll get to the download page first okay here we are this is a bootstrap theme and if I view it there's no actual images in the file they're all links to Unsplash. So that hero area is linked to this one, this kind of article section, and a sort of a gallery. That's, all, that's a wire frame I made. And there's no images in the actual file in the root folder. Okay, so how do we do this? Let's go and have a look at the code. Okay, just on the HTML page index page for that wireframe and here is a section area for the hero the hero image so section class hero section which will be the CSS rules style equals background image URL hypertext transfer protocol unsplash dot IT as in random so that's making it random each time each time it's going to go let's have a look okay I'm previewing in the browser just here our area and the background image is another one a random randomly taken from that HTTP link which is unsplash you know, different again I think that was the same as last one on the gallery section so they might be specific let's go and have a look okay so here's the code start equals background image URL HTTPS unsplash.it. I don't know, is that Italy or something? 1400 random. Question mark and random. So that will do it if you want to copy that. Let's go and look down further down. Okay, I'm further down the page, and this section is a light box image. It's like a gallery, and the href here for the images unsplash.it. That's the website. So page 800 and then 600 image equals 55. So that's specific. Image 55, 56, 57, 58. I'm going to preview that in the browser and have a look. So they should be the same all every time. Okay, previewing in the browser again. And again, a randomly taken picture. I scroll down to that light box kind of gallery. And yes, it's the same. They're the same ones. 56, 57, 58. Or was it 55 or whatever? They're directly taken a specific picture, so you can do that. You can do that as well. Let's go to look at the HTML. Okay, here it is. HTTP unsplash 55, 56, 57, 58. So let's. So there it is. If you want to use a very good way to reduce file size, because it's the heaviest thing. HTML is nothing. JavaScript is a little bit more. Images are by far the heaviest thing on your file size, so you could do it this way. Um, let's have another look at Unsplash. Okay, I'm back on Unsplash. So I'm, I'm taking a look at this picture. The HTTP is there. So I suppose you would just put that in as the background URL if you liked that particular one. But if you want more on it, you can just download my code from fourthemes.co.uk you try it that way